Good afternoon everyone, it's Tanya of Cute and Cuddly Nursery. I have little Aspen awake here and she is a real born kit so she was um, 3D printed from scans of a real baby, the real Aspen, and then um, made into vinyl kits. So I did have her nicely wrapped but I um, wanted to quickly do a box packing video and show her off and I'm just going to take her pacifier. So this is her little pacifier here. It is a Nuck brand, just um, simple. Got a little gray bunny. It's got little grass in the bottom and it's, oh I was going to say it's textured but it just says made in Germany on the bottom. And then it's got two gray trees on either side. I'm just going to put it in a little organza bag there and close it up. And I'm going to just stick it off to the... Oh, I forgot. almost forgot her little head hair bow and the little flower that I made. And they're just magnetic. Um, so I'm just going to stick those together with her pacifier. Just so they all go together now that I... Um, I don't do very many of the magnetic hair bows or anything like that, but I just wanted to for Aspen since she's so cute and she needs some, you know, something besides her um, bow. And I do have a bow for her as well, and it's in her little... Oops, upside down. You can kind of see her polka dotted outfit in here and then I put the headband right here and then on the back and behind um, is her blue uh, onesie that she was in before. So I'm just going to stick that there on the side and then I'll get her papers ready and then we'll put her in the box. So I'll show you what she's also coming home with. So this is her um, birth certificate, um, and then this is her COA, Get the glare of the sun on there, there we go, her COA, and I don't fill them out, I just leave them as is, and then also three of my business cards, and this is her care instructions that I, I just fill out, you know, um, the size of clothing they wear, um, and also what kit they are, and that way I just have to print them out. Um, I do have to change if they are, um, have rooted hair or painted hair, then I have to, of course, go in and I change that, um, and I just kind of simplify it if they have, um, painted hair versus rooted hair. Of course there's not as much um, maintenance when they just have painted hair. And I'm just going to stick this little ducky just to seal the envelope. I'm just going to leave him there. It is a little one that's puffed up so <laughs> it makes noise when I put it down. Or I'll stick it on there. Okay. Now, I'm going to show you, wait, let's show off her little toy first. So this attaches to like the crib or a stroller. And it's just a little bunny um, lovey. And I thought it was really cute. And the tag has three little carrots on it. Oh, there we go. Now it's going to focus. Three little carrots. And then the other side says bunnies by the bay. That gets cute. Okay, now put that off to the side. I'm just going to grab her so I can show her off a little before I tuck her into her box. So here she is. This is Aspen Awake. I'll take her hat off. So here's her um, painted hair. I tried to put detail 
in um, along the sides and the back. So I hope you can all see that. The sun's trying to go down on me already. I'm not done with the box packing. Here she is. I think she's just adorable. Um, I wasn't sure about this kit when I first ordered her. And then when I got her, her head was a little squished. But once I got her... Um, painted and um, of course put the stuffing and weight into her head. It, um, her head no longer is all squished looking. Um, just her ears were in and so now um, she's definitely cuter and I just love her so I hope her mommy will love her as well. And um, like the other baby, this one's not going very far either. So um, I did swap um, boxes with the other baby, with Joseph. If you saw Joseph's box packing yesterday, he was in a rather small box. And she's shorter, so she fits in here really nicely. So um, he was in a small box and I just felt bad closing it because it didn't close the best. So um, I actually switched him over to a much bigger box to where he has plenty of room now. So I can close it and get it ready for pickup. Oh look at her, she's so cute. And so I am going to put her in the smaller box because, well, she's smaller than he is. Uh, let's see if I can tuck her little face in. There we go. Aww. <laughs> so, I'm just going to put her in the box. She's actually got more room in here. Maybe we'll just slide her in. Yeah, there we go. A little bit further. And then... Um, I am going to grab some diapers for her as well. So here she is in the box. I'm going to grab some diapers um, to put in um, next to her head here. Let's try to fit her in there a little more. And that way it'll protect her head. And provide more cushion, of course. Um, let me see. Oh, I was gonna see where did I put that other gift? So I'm gonna put that at her feet, and then her little lovey uh, toy can go up here next to her head. And. Sorry about that. I will edit this into the um, as one video, but I had a phone call, so I went ahead and I grabbed the little diapers. So these are newborn. These are Winnie the Pooh theme. I actually sell these in my Etsy shop. They're just little huggies. So I'm going to add these right next to her head, like I said I would. I got her little lovey in there as well. I'm just gonna scoot her down a little. And I'm gonna put her put her clothes under her feet actually. Um so there's still room here, but like I said, she's not gonna be going in the mail or anything. Um she's just gonna be picked up. So I'm just gonna leave her um I think with that space. Um I don't really have anything to put in there. I would if she was going further. And here's her pacifier and her little hair things. And I'm just going to stick those down at the bottom. And then her papers. I think I'm just going to gently fold like so. And then, oh, you can see the box. 
I am using a recycled box. <laughs> Normally when I do send a baby, if anyone has gotten one, they are sent in a brand new box. Um, I just like a brand new box if they've been shipped before I worry that they could um, they might not be as sturdy as they used to be but like I said she's not going far so this will be nice for her and it'll be fine um, I'm not worried about the box getting damaged or anything like that so I think that's everything in there so I just put a another um, plain piece of tissue paper over top just so it looks nice and clean and you know it's a surprise you pull it off and everything's under there so okay um I think that's it for now um so thank you all so much for watching and I hope you have a wonderful day